subscribe to my channel now remember subscribe to my channel see you Welcome to my YouTube channel and welcome to my video today. Today it's a video about Benny Lewis who say that he is a polyglot. But let's find out and see if he can really speak all those language that he say that he can speak. First of all, I want to say thank you to my subscribers and to my viewers. Especially thank you to my subscribers for subscribing to my YouTube channel. If you're not subscribed yet, hit the subscribe button so let's continue watching more videos of Benny Lewis thank you for watching let's continue okay let's see his net next video here Nubian history chat in Arabic about et ethnic group in Egypt so a video less than seven minutes less than seven minutes speaking in Arabic and the one before in 17 minutes it was very fake and the woman was also speaking a lot in that video so when the woman is also speaking it means that he's if he speak half of this 17 minute it's like it's only around 16 minute because in the start there was some music and end of the video there's also this music where he showed the map when he showed this map the first few seconds and also the end like that but let's say 16 or 17 minutes like that and if she is speaking if the woman is speaking half of the time so he's only speaking in eight minutes or something like that eight or nine minutes but he but still he was looking and reading from some script and when she, when she was speaking when she was speaking she was speaking a lot but when he was speaking most of the time he was just speaking slowly and saying few words sometimes he say a long sentence or look like he is speaking good sometimes it looks like he was speaking good he say a long sentence or two or three long sentence but it was just some memorized stuff but it's not totally memorized maybe he did not totally memorize because he looked down on some paper so it, maybe he just look and read from the script but let's see this next video in six minutes or seven minutes Welcome to Aswan. This was my first stop in Egypt outside of Cairo. It's a city in the very south where the Egyptian part of the When he go to the city then he ha then he can sit in the hotel or something like that and prepare a script. But when he was in a in the desert it was more difficult for him to prepare some script. But in the city he can sit at the hotel prepare some script before he go out. After leaving Cairo, the first stop on my Egyptian travel was Aswan, the first south in the country where you can find a major settled area and where the Egyptian part of the Nile begins after Lake Nasser and High Dam. By far the most interesting part of my time there was discovering things about the ethnic group known as the Nubians which at one point in history were able to over overpower the pharaohs of Egypt but have had an offering blah 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 okay and to share that story I let Gasser Emanuar a Nubian working in the tourist industry take the microphone to share his perspective on it all with us with subtitles in English and Arabic as always okay okay um let's see how much he will speak in this video
Islands after Lake Nasser. But that lake wasn't always there. It's the largest artificial lake in the world, created when the high dam was built in the 60s to control flooding in the Nile and provide hydroelectric power for Egypt. Unfortunately, this new artificial lake flooded ancestral lands and displaced the ethnic group known as the Nubians, who had been living there since ancient times. They now have villages with mostly Nubian populations around this area, one of the largest being on Elephantine Island. I met several of them, one of whom sailed my felucca boat down the Nile, and another, Jasser, who let me ask him some questions to share the story of his people. Okay, so already the, f the first minute is in English. Also, this is another edit. Like, first he is outside here. First he's outside here on the Nile or outside here. After f around 58 seconds, at 58 seconds is a different video. Like he put many videos, many clips together. So it's a new recording. Like this, this is a recording or many recordings. And after he will start another recording at 58 seconds. And at 58 seconds, when he's going to start to speak, you can see it's like he... When he's going to speak, it looks like someone who is who just memorize what he's going to say. Like he pra he practice few questions, like he practice few questions how to say those questions that he will ask him. So he just practice few questions what he will ask him in the video, and maybe the other guy is the one speaking most of the time. Also now it's already one minute will be gone. So if this is 6 minutes and 44 and 1 minute is gone, so it's 5.44. So it's like 5-6 minutes video. Because the first 1 minute he's speaking in English. The first 1 minute here he's speaking in English. So it means that only 5 or 6 minutes, maybe in Arabic or less. And the other guy is also speaking. So I think he will only ask few questions in Arabic. He just prepare few questions. This Benny Lewis, he just prepare few questions in Arabic that he practice and memorize how to say those few questions. It doesn't mean that he can speak Arabic. It doesn't mean that he can speak Arabic because he practice few questions that he will ask him in Arabic. I met several of them, one of whom sailed my felucca boat down the Nile, and another, Jasser, who let me ask him some questions to share the story of his people. <laughs> وانا انا عايز اتكلم عن ناس نوبي okay. uh, ايه هو تاريخ النوبه there was an edit there there was an edit there but if you understand about editing you will see it so he only speak for 4 or 5 seconds no like 3 or 4 or 5 seconds then there was an edit he speak for fi from 58 or 59 seconds. He starts speaking from 58 or 59 seconds. And then here around 103 or 104, there's an edit. Around 103 or 104, there's an edit. Also when he speak, his pronunciation is not really that good. And he's just memorized something. And I don't know if he also have some script that he's reading from on the table there or something but let's continue but just notice after two seconds i will show it more than one time i think after two seconds you will see there's some flash like that there's some edit it means that he could only say a few words and then he could not remember how to say it. then he stopped the recording and then after he will start the recording again it's very fake bullshit just look after two seconds there's an edit just just concentrate and look, there's some edit now. Well, I I Try to look. I will show it again now. If you did not notice it, I will show it one more time or two more times. Here you can notice it, like you can see on Benny Lewis and the other guy. There's some blurry thing, blurry thing around their body, some blurry, blurry thing around their body. You can see some blurry thing around their body, around their head and arms, 
around their head and arms and like that you can see there's something blurry when there's something blurry there's because there was some edit because when he was asking something in Arabic he, can, he cannot remember how to say like Benny Lewis he said few words to ask him the question then he cannot remember the rest of the question that's why he made some edit and then he want to tell us he want to tell us he become fluent or good in Arabic in three months that's why you edit and only ask some question you you memorize he memorized the question and still he cannot say it even he practice and memorize the question still he cannot say it he have to edit he cannot even say something he practice and memorize for many hours few questions few questions few questions he practice and memorized for for many hours he cannot even say it without editing without editing and without wrong pronunciation and speaking very slow and wrong grammar everything wrong 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 then how can you say that he can speak arabic if you do like this just some fake shit i will show you again i will go back one or two or three more times i want to show you this again there's some edit just look when i go back then look at their head around their head around their head around their arms and body around them there will be something blurry there will be something blurry around their head and their arms because there's something there's like an edit there's an edit when there's something blurry there it's because there's an edit he only speak for like three or four seconds then there was an edit he could not even say the whole question he could not even ask the whole question without an edit he could not ask one question without he edit he could not remember even one question he could not remember it because he don't know how to speak Arabic he don't know how to speak Arabic that's why he could not even ask the whole question without he makes some edit also he read the question many times from his paper or laptop he read the question many times before he start the video he read the question many times before he start the video and still he could only say few words and then he could not remember even he just read the question even he just read the question before he start the video still he could not say the question it means that he cannot speak arabic at all it's totally fake i will go back again and try to look around them there will be something blurry because there's some edit these people <laughs> وانا انا عايز اتكلم عن نص نوبي okay. uh, هو تاريخ I will show again here in slow motion the blurry part just try to look and concentrate especially on the guy on the right side you can see there's some blurry on his head and body like that when he's moving look 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 it's very blurry look now look I will show it many times this one look look the guy on the right side Look on the guy on the right side, look how blurry, look how blurry it is, it's very blurry, you can see, because there's some edit. Benny Lewis could only speak for a few seconds, saying few words, then he could not remember the rest of the question, that's why he makes some edit there, because he cannot speak Arabic, but he will pretend that he will learn Arabic in three months, but he's just memorizing some question. And then he will edit, he will just go and read from some paper or some computer. Then after he will edit and cut it out when he look and read from the paper or computer. You can see how blurry it is. It's very fake. He cannot speak Arabic, he cannot speak any language. All those polyglot YouTubers, they're just fake and editing their videos and memorizing some sentence and reading from some script. Did you see something blurry and also you see some shaking? especially on the guy on the right side it was very clear there was something his did you see how his body was shaking or blurry like that try to concentrate i will show it again he only speak for four or five seconds like that he only speak for like four or five seconds then there's an edit and he speak very slow and he cannot even say the words correctly i will show it again just concentrate concentrate and look around and if you want to see it more times you can always you can always also do it on the video you can just move back and watch it more times if you do not if you don't notice when i show it 
just try to concentrate there will be something blurry around them and also some shaking you'll see the guy on the right side you will especially notice on him but both of them you'll see it on both of them but especially on the guy on the right side you'll see that his like his body there's some sh little bit shaking and blurry like that i will show it again of his people. We're in Fiaswan and I want to talk about our Nubi. It's the history of Nubi. Did you see there was something blurry? Also I think you can see it maybe from the play button now. Look where the play button is at the end of the body of this guy on the right side. The guy on the right side you can see the play button is just there at the end of his arm but i think if you go a few seconds back he will not be at the play button no let's see here look now the play button is like few millimeters the play button is few millimeters away from the body on the guy on the right side. Also, he's standing different. Like he's standing more to the side like that. Like his body is more to the side like that. He's more f like looking at Le Benny Lewis. Look where the play button now is a few millimeters away from him. And the next button on the right side, the next button, this next button on the right side is a little bit away from him. And after a few seconds, his body will be a little bit more far from the next button. And also you see this shaking and blurry thing. Just look again. Okay. Uh, Did you see the shaking like that? Some blurry shaking like this. And also the play button now is on his body. Just at the end of his body. Before there was few millimeters between the play button and, and the guy on the right side. Because there's some edit. He could not even speak for a few seconds without an edit because he cannot speak Arabic. He only prepare what he will ask him and he just read from a script. And when he cannot remember, he stopped the video, then he start another recording like that. That's why there's some edit, just some fake shit. ...to share the story of his people. <laughs> And I'm going to talk about Nubi. Okay. Okay. ومعروفة طبعا في يوم من الأيام اللوبيين حبوا يحتلوا مصر الفرعونية في الأسرة الفرعونية الخمسة وعشرين الملك النوبي طهاركا هو احتل مصر حتى شمال وقعدوا حوالي سنتين بيحكموا مصر لغاية ما مصر استعاد توازنها مرة تانية مصر الفرعونية وجوم قادوا على النوبة كلها أو معظمها وهدموا المعابد النوبية حاولوا يدمروا أي شيء يعني Look, the guy on the right side is speaking for almost one minute now. The guy on the right side is the one who is speaking the whole time. And Benny Lewis, he only asked him a question. And then even when Benny Lewis asked him the question, then he makes some edit because he could not even remember the question. Just some fake bullshit. And also something else, but it's not for, for me. It's not really important for me. But like if Benny Lewis... If you think he knows something about Egypt or Egyptian or Arabic, 
then actually what he's doing now is wrong but I don't really care about it just I want to mention something for me I don't care but I just want to mention that right now when they're speaking you can hear something like that you can hear some sound like that it's not a music it's not some music what you can hear is like the calling for, for for prayer in the mosque in the mosque they call for prayer they say this Allahu Akbar Allahu Akbar like that they're calling for prayer like that there's some sound now you can hear you can hear them now in the mosque on the microphone from the mosque you can hear you can hear they're calling for prayer and normally in Egypt normally in Egypt unless unless this guy is Christian or something this, unless this guy on the right side is Christian but still mostly in Egypt when you can hear the prayer in the mosque then most of the time you will not be talking or making some interview at the same time you will you will not speak together when there's the the sound of the prayer you'll just wait for a few seconds or one minute till the prayer is done then you will continue talking and maybe if you're not a religious person but for me also I don't really care about it but if you're not a religious person maybe you'll just say uh, you maybe you will wonder maybe you'll say like why should they care about that or they should just make the interview if they want or something like that but mostly they will respect that there's some prayer you can hear then they will continue later but it's not really a big deal if they started already the interview before the prayer but what I mean is that this Benny Lewis he want to make it look like he know everything about the language know everything about the culture and like that if he did know about the language about the culture then he will also know that that he should wait few minutes until this pray this prayer calling is finished then he will continue but I don't really care about that just I want to mention that this Benny Lewis, he don't really know anything about the country or the religion or anything like that. And he also don't know the language. And the guy now, the guy now on the right side, he's the one who have been speaking for almost one minute now. Benny Lewis only asked one question and he ate it. When he asked the question, he ate it. And the guy on the right side, he's the one who's speaking a lot. You can see the guy on the right side, he's the one who keeps speaking. But Benny Lewis, he only asked one question until now. عبر عن النوبة ويتكلم عن النوبة بس مع مرور الأيام ابتدى النوبين يعني يقلوا يعني كمياتنا مش كبيرة عدد أم 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 okay you you we know you can say أم Benny Lewis Benny Lewis we know you and other polyglots can we know you and other polyglots can say أم أم آ آ أم أم آ آ آ آ أم uh -uh. so if you want if you want to do same like, like the polyglot youtubers if you want to do same like the polyglot youtubers and speak 10 or 20 language or 50 language you should just keep saying um, uh, um, uh, and then maybe you can say one or two words in a language if you want to speak Arabic you can just say one or two words that um, um, uh, 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 then one or two words that um, 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 uh, and, and then and then you can let the other person speaking like now he just let the other person speaking and then you if you want to do and then what if you want to do the same in spanish in spanish also you can also just say one or two words in spanish and then like that and then let another person speaking you fake f holman مش كتير بين مصر وبين السودان لغاية كانت يعني ممكن نقول بداية الكوارث لما المصريين بنوا خزان أسوان سنة 1902 هجروا بعض أهم 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 What language is this أهم أهم What language is this What language are you speaking now بين اللوس بين اللوس هول أهم 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 and the other guy is speaking for more than one minute now. بنوا الخزان ده في أرضنا وجم سنة 1912 عملوا تعليق الخزان أسوان هجروا مجموعة تانية من النوبيين وكانت الكرسة الأكبر لنا سنة 1960 في عهد الرئيس المصري جمال عبد الناصر لما قرر يبني السد العالي 
فالسد العالي ياخذ مساحه كبيره من اراضي النوبيه فهو هجر كل النوبيين اللي كانوا عايشين في المنطقه هناك ووعدوا النوبيين انهم هيدوهم ارض ثانيه بدال الارض اللي خسروها ووعد النوبيين ايضا الرئيس جمال عبد الناصر ان في بحيره هتنتج عن السد العالي هيسموها بحيره النوبه لكن بعد ما اتعمل السد العالي سموها بحيره ناصر على اسم الرئيس المصري سموهاش بحيره النوبه ووعدوا كل نوبي اللي كان عنده نخله هياخد نخله اللي كان عنده بيت هياخد بيت الناس كانت كلها مزارعين النوبيين عايشين على النيل <تصفيق> لما هجروهم ودوهم في كومومبو مركز تابع لاسوان ودوهم في الصحراء بعيد جدا عن النيل فالنوبيين يعني نسبه كبيره من النوبيين تهجر Why there's no edit now? Ben Lewis, why you don't make an edit now when the other guy is speaking? Why you don't make some edit when the other guy is speaking because the other guy can speak Arabic? You don't make an edit now because the other guy can speak Arabic then you don't need to edit. Only when you speak then you make some edit because you cannot speak Arabic. Now the other guy is speaking then you don't need to make some edit. Only when you speak you make some edit because you cannot speak Arabic. And the other guy is speaking for two minutes already or more than two minutes now the other guy is speaking for two minutes and Benny Lewis he only asked one question and when he asked the question there was some edit already after a few seconds <laughs> معظم الرجال يعني هاجروا لبلاد الخليج العربي عشان يلاقوا عمل ما في شغل في بلاد التهجير فيمكن النساء والاطفال بس هم اللي موجودين هناك لانه كله بيعمل في الخليج في الكويت والسعوديه والامارات لكن زي هنا جزيره الفانتينا وجزيره اسوان والقرى المحيطه احنا ما تهجرناش عشان احنا بعيد من السد العالي فاحنا طول عمرنا عايشين هنا ومحافظين حتى الان على عاداتنا وتقاليدنا <تصفيق> Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Wow, you're very good in Arabic. You're fluent. Benny Lewis, you are fluent in Arabic. You can say mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Benny Lewis is fluent in Arabic because he can say mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Oh, wow, you are very fluent in Arabic. People who are watching now, people who are watching now, if you if you can say mm-hmm, 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 then you are also fluent in Arabic. If you're watching now and listening now to this video, Try to say mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Did you say mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm? If you say it mm-hmm or ahem, 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 if you can say any sound like this, then you're fluent in Arabic. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if you can say mm-hmm, 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 you're fluent in Arabic. Or if you can, no, if you can say mm-hmm, 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 then you're fluent in 10 language or 20 language. You can speak all language in the world. If you can say mm-hmm, mm-hmm, same like Benny Lewis. Just say mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and then let another person speak the language. Let another person speak the language and say mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. then you're fluent in the language. <laughs> يعني صعب انه مصري يعيش في قريه نوبيه مع المصريين ممكن يكون في صداقه لكن زواج صعب ممكن بيحدث الان قليل جدا مش كثير لكن برضه لينا الخصوصيه بتاعتنا بس حتى تاريخنا هذا كل الحكومات المصريه اللي جاءت رئيس عبد الناصر والرئيس سادات والرئيس مبارك كلهم كانوا بيوعدوا النوبيين ياخذوا حقوقهم لكن حتى الان ما فيش حتى حكومه بعد الثوره حتى الان احنا منتظرين لكن لسه ما في جديد حتى يعني الرئيس The other guy is already speaking for three minutes or something now. The other guy is speaking for three minutes and Benny Lewis, he only asked him one question. And the one question when he asked him, he made some edit. He could not even say the question without an edit. Benny Lewis only asked one question and he could not do it without making an edit. And when he asked the question also, he was speaking bad pronunciation and wrong grammar and just... Like he could not even make it sound correct. He could not even make the question sound to totally correctly. And there was some edit also. Only one question with an edit and wrong grammar and wrong pronunciation. And then now the other guy is the one who's speaking the whole video. رئيس محمد مرسي في واحد من المتحدثين باسمه أيام الفترة الانتخابية قال الجالية النوبية في مصر الجالية تعني الناس اغراب لكن احنا مش اغراب دي بلدنا لما يقول جاليه جال جاليه سودانيه جاليه افريقيه جاليه اوروبيه لكن احنا مش جاليه وكان اعتذر بعد كده هو عن الكلمه دي احنا لغايه يومنا هذا عايشين والحمد لله ومبسوطين واحنا فخورين ان احنا عايشين اها 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 مستر بيني لويس اها 
Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's first time I know that you can speak Egyptian like this. This is the first time I know this Benny Lewis. Benny Lewis. Benny Lewis is the first time I know you can speak Egyptian but by just saying mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's the first time I know that a person can speak Egyptian by just saying mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> Yeah Fuck Old son of a Man عشان مصر تاريخ عظيم مصر مذكورة في القرآن الدولة الوحيدة اللي مذكورة في القرآن ربنا قال ادخلوا مصر آمنين فاحنا فخورين ان احنا موجودين في مصر الحمد لله و هل هل و و هل 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 و و هل 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 is that fluent is that fluent you son of a you son of a is that fluent like you cannot even say the word like he want to say wahal wahal then he like it just it's just two words even the fir first word is only one letter the first word wa is 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 one letter only and the second word is only two letters like wa is wow wa to say wa is just wow and hal is only he and the lamb he lamb like h l it's only three letters he's going to say two words like one first word is one letter and second word is two letters first word wa is only one letter second word hal is only two letters but still he cannot say it he keep like wa 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 is that fluent in Arabic, you son of a? You just practice this. I want to see if there's some edit there, but I'm not sure if there's some edit in this one before he asked this question, or maybe he just memorized it. Let's go back a few seconds. I want to see if there was some edit. I think there was an edit, but it was not so clear. الحمد لله و هل هل في في لغه ثانيه ال الناس النوبي يتكلموا انا انا عارف انا عارف انتو يتكلموا العربي لا لكن في في لغات نوبي طبعا في لغتين نوبي is that fluent you son of a he just memorized the question and then he cannot even say the question correctly it's just like what the هل هل في في لغة تانية؟ عظيم مصر مذكورة في القرآن الدولة الوحيدة اللي مذكورة في القرآن ربنا قال ادخلوا مصر عاملين فاحنا فخورين إن إحنا موجودين في مصر الحمد لله. Just listen now, listen now when he will speak. It's like وهل هل هل في في لغة 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 لغ He's speaking like that. He's speaking like this, like wah la 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 fi la ga 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 ta 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 like that fuck wa hal hal fi fi lugha tania el in nasun wa hal hal fi lugha tania it's like you ask him is there another language wa hal lugha tania يتكلموا أنا أنا عاري أنا عارف يتكلموا أنا أخف أنا أخف
What an Arif. An Arif. His pronunciation is totally wrong. And his grammar is wrong. And he just say few words. He just say few words. But in the translation, in the in the translation, in this translation here, he will make it look like he's speaking good, but he cannot even speak. It's just like a three year old a three year old Egyptian or two years old Egyptian can speak better than you someone who just a little kid a little baby who just started to learn to speak a little Egyptian baby who is two years or three years old who's just started to learn to speak Egyptian can speak better than you a little baby who just started to learn how to speak can speak better than you and you also just memorize the question you just memorize what you will ask and even you, and even you memorize then still like Allah <laughs> fucking fake shit fake shit into you you come to al arabi la lakin fi fi lughat nubi taban fi lughatain nubi his pronunciation and his grammar and the way he say the words is totally wrong. He say the words wrong and wrong, like wrong pronunciation. He say wrong words. He don't know how to speak at all. It's fuck. Arabic, لا لكن في في لغات نوبي. طبعا في لغتين نوبيتين نوبة الكنزية ولغة الكنزية موجودين في مصر. الحمد لله. Wow. I show the same many times, so it's not because he speak for longer time. You see, I go back many times. I just show the same many times. It doesn't mean that he is it's the same question. It's just one question. So you don't think that he is speaking for five minutes now just because I show the same question many times because I want to notice the way he speak like it's very funny. Hal fi fi lugatanya. Uh, in in uh, also Nubi, uh, it calmo. Uh, and and I and I know if into it it come to al al Arabi. La la can fi into it come to into it come to al Arabi into it come to what it come to we come to. It's not yet into it come to. There's no word yet come to. It should be tatakalamu and to tatak and to tatakalamu. Antum tatakalamu. It should not be uh, tatakamtu. Takamtu. What is takamtu? There's no such word takamtu. He say takamtu. He he even say a wrong word, like he will say the word wrong. The correct word tatakalamu. The correct word is tatakalamu, but he will say takamtu. Takamtu. He will say takamtu, but the correct word is tatakalamu. The correct word tatak is the correct word is Tata Kalamu. The correct word is Tata Kalamu. But Benny Lewis, he will say Takamtu. Takamtu. What Takamtu, you fuck? All the words, or m many of the words, many of the words, he's saying it wrong, wrong pronunciation, and speaking very slow, and like, like he just say a few words, and you cannot even understand what the fuck he's saying like that. And then he want to say that he's fluent or can speak the language. He just only ask two questions. He ask one question in at minute one. At minute one he ask a question, and now at minute five he ask a question. Two questions, and in the first question there was some edit in the first question. Now in the second question he also like ah he cannot speak and saying wrong words, wrong words, wrong pronunciation. He say words that is totally wrong, like he will say. Like he want to say a word, then he will say another word. He want to he want to say tatakalamu. He wanted to say tatakalamu, but he will say tatakamtu, tatakamtu, or something like that. He will say totally wrong word. He will say totally wrong word. Also wrong pronunciation. Some of the words wrong, or most of the words wrong pronunciation. And he speak very bad, very slow. And it's just some memorized stuff. He just memorized two questions. He memorized two questions. And still he cannot pronounce them correctly or say the words correctly. 
Yes, some bullshit. What fluent in three months? What fluent in three months? You cannot speak anything. You cannot speak anything in Arabic. You f man, you cannot speak anything in Arabic. Only you memorize two questions. Only you memorize two questions and you say it wrong. Wrong words, wrong grammar, wrong pronunciation. Only a few words and ah, 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 like that. And also editing, also editing, fake. Just bullshit. And the other guy is the one speaking for how many minutes? The other guy is the one who's speaking for four or five minutes like that. Logat Nubi. Taban, few Logatin Nubi, Nubal Kinzia, Logal Kinzia, or Nubal Fajiki. Aha. Fahna Hena was a Jizira Taswana or Elephant. Aha. Okay, you can say aha. Okay, now you can speak Arabic because you can say aha. You fuck. Kinzia. Like a Mozam, a Halit Tahir to Saint Felmia Fajikia. فاحنا مش بنفهم بعض الكنزي ما بيش مش بيفهم الفجيك والفجيك مش بيفهم الكنزي وطبعا المصري مش بيفهم ده واحنا طبعا مبسوطين بكده احنا بنتكلم عربي وبنتكلم لغاتنا الخاصه برضه ومعلومه برضه اللغه النوبيه المصريين استخدموا look how much the other guy is speaking look how many sentences and how much the other guy is speaking look how much the other guy is speaking the whole video the other guy is speaking the whole video and this Benny Lewis shit Told he only asked two questions. The first question was edited. There was some edit in the first question. He could not even remember the whole question. And the second question is just like ah, 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 and then wrong, wrong pronunciation, wrong words, everything wrong. Just some fake. Thirty-three seventy-nine. The Maghreb Israel, so they are able to speak Arabic very well. وأي شفرة ممكن نتكلم بها ممكن يحلوا أي شفرة لكن اللغة النوبية كانت حاجة جديدة تماما فاستفادوا بها في حرب أكتوبر 73 هل في أي أي حاجة أنت أنت look there was another edit question number three now question number three now then he make an edit after the guy finished speaking after the guy finished speaking then he make an edit to ask the next next question I am very sure he just go and read the question. Maybe that's also why the guy he looked like he's smiling and laughing. I think the guy on the right side look at his face. Look the face on the guy on the right side. He's like smiling and laughing. I think he's laughing at him. Maybe he's thinking like what is wrong with this guy. I think the right the guy on the right side he's smiling and laughing. He's thinking like what's wrong with this guy. He go and and read the question. He don't he cannot even speak Arabic and then he want to pretend he can speak Arabic or something like that. You can see the guy on the right side looks like he's laughing or smiling. I think he's laughing at him because it's so fake. But I will show you now there was some edit. After the guy on the right side, the guy on the right side he was speaking. After he finished speaking, then there was some edit. And again, you will see something blurry like that. You will see something blurry because there was some edit there. Look now after a few seconds. After a few seconds when the guy stops speaking, then there's an edit. After a few seconds when the guy on the right side stops speaking, then there's an edit. I think he stopped the video. I think Benny Lewis, he stopped the video or maybe he did not stop it. Maybe he continued, but maybe he'd go and look and read the question and go back again. And then after he would cut it out. Maybe he tell him what maybe he tell that guy on the right side. Maybe Benny Lewis told the guy on the right side just wait a minute, then he go and look at the table. Maybe on the table he have some paper with a question, then he go and read the next question, then he go and ask him the question. Then after the video finish he edit and cut it out. But look after a few seconds. After a few seconds you will see there's some blurry thing. There's some blurry thing around them and some shaking like that because there's some edit. Because Benny Lewis, he go and read the question. He go and read the next question and then continue the video. After a few seconds, you will see there's some edit and some blurry thing and shaking like that. But let's see here where is the play button and the other buttons. I just want to see. You can see there's this box. There's some box over his head. The guy on the right side, you can see the box over his head. Just try to look where is the different buttons, where's the different buttons and then look if there's some change after a few seconds. The box is over his head and the play button and the other button is just on both sides of him. 
let's see after a few seconds but try to look now also try to notice there's something blurry and shaking after a few seconds when he stops speaking there will come some blurry and shaking stuff like that I Look, this one is in normal speed. Then now I will show you again in slow motion. I will show you now also in slow motion. Then you can see, especially, you can see it on Benny Lewis. It becomes very blurry on the, blurry on the face of Benny Lewis. Look now, I will show it many times in slow motion here. Look at the face of Benny Lewis. Look at his face. It's very blurry. Look at the face of Benny Lewis. It's very blurry because there's some edit. You can see the face of Benny Lewis is very blurry because there's some edit. Because he cannot speak Arabic. He just go and look and read the text. And then he will go back and talk. And after he will cut it out. He will cut it out when he go and look from some paper or some laptop. That's why you can see there's a lot of blurry on his face because there's some edit. You cannot even ask two or three questions in the video without he makes some edit because he cannot speak Arabic. It's all fake. It's all fake. All of these polyglot YouTubers and this language learning community are just some fake people pretending to speak many languages, but they cannot do that. Most of them can only speak one language, maybe two languages. They're just fake and pretending. All those polyglot YouTubers are just fake and editing their videos and reading from some script and memorizing some few sentences like that. It's all fake. All those polyglot YouTubers are fake. And this whole language learning community is just some fake people. They do this kind of thing so people think they can speak many languages. And after that they will sell some ebooks or make some language course or some things like that just to scam people they're just some fake people who want to scam people they're just some fake scammers all of this language learning community all this language learning community are just some fake people who want to scam people they're just fake and all they want to do is to scam people only they want to make money scamming people all those polyglot youtubers and linguistic and other fake language learning community they're just some scammers who want to make money scamming people Okay, they're standing at the same place, I think almost the same place, but but you will note, but if you look at the blurry thing, the blurry thing was on Benny Lewis. I will go back a few seconds, then try to look at Benny Lewis' head. Try to look at his head and face around his head. Try to look around the head of Benny Lewis, then you will see something blurry. I'll go back again a few seconds, and when I play, try to concentrate around Benny Lewis head you'll see something blurry like that because there's some edit after a few seconds try to look around Benny Lewis head try to look around Benny Lewis head there will be something blurry just for a second like that there will be something blurry around Benny Lewis head because there's some edit he made some edit after he read the next question after he read the next question he made some edit he cut it out or he make a new recording like that I will play now I'll play now the video and then look after a few seconds try to concentrate on Benny Lewis head you will see something blurry like that because there's an edit Look around Ben Lewis' head, there will be something blurry. Just look now. Did you see around Ben Lewis' head, there was something blurry and like his head was a little bit shaking. Like there was something blurry around Ben Lewis' head and there was some shaking on his head like that. Like his head keeps, like there was some shake to the right and the left some little bit shake to the right and the left like that with Ben Lewis head and something blurry you know, like his head there was some shaking and blurry like that I'll move it back one more time and just try to concentrate after a few seconds just when I play the when, when I play the video now look at Benny Lewis head 
you will see some shaking and some blurry at Ben Lewis head you see some shaking and some blurry because there's some edit لكن اللغة النوبية كانت حاجة جديدة تماما فاستفادوا بيها في حرب اكتوبر 73 هل في اي اي حاجة انت عايزة Did you notice there was some blurry and some shaking like that because there was some edit there and also you ask him just a normal question like do you want to say anything else and then he also pronounced it wrong or I think he wait I'll just hear now I want to hear it I want to hear what he's saying because I want to concentrate. I think he's saying also speaking wrong way. It's not Aiza. It's not Aiza. It's Aiza. Aiza. Ain. 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 Aiza. Aiza. Also, anti Aiza is wrong. Anti Aiza is for woman. Two words that is feminine. He used two feminine words to a man. He is speaking to a man, but he speak. He used two feminine words, and he also did that with the woman. In the video before the 17 minute video, in the 17 minute video, he also say anta to the woman. To the woman, he say anta, and anta is for man. And now to the guy, he's, to the man, he say anti, and anti is for woman. Anta means you, anta or anti means you. Anta is for masculine, for man. Anta means you is for masculine, for man. Anti, anti, t, t. Can you he, can you hear the difference? Try to hear the difference. An, te, te, an, te, te, an, te. Ante, ante means you and is for man. Is for a man for masculine. Ante is for masculine. It means you. Ante means you is for masculine. But for feminine, for woman or girl, for woman or girl, for feminine, you say ante, t, t, ante, ante, ante is for woman. Also, he say aiza, aiza. Aiza is for woman, for feminine. He said Aiza. Aiza is for feminine, for woman. If he's speaking to a guy, he should say Aiz. Aiz. Not Aiza. For a man, for a man, it should be Aiz. For a woman, it should be Aiza. He said to him, he said to him, anti Aiza, anti Aiza. But the correct, the correct is Enta Aiz. The correct is enter eyes. When you speak to the man, he should say enter eyes. But he said anti eyesa. Anti eyesa is for woman, for feminine. He say wrong, and also it's just something simple. Like he just say anti eyesa hagatanya. Just like you want something else or anything else. It's just something simple he memorized. Just something simple he memorized. Also, there was some edits, so he just go and read the question. He just a simple question, he go and read, and still he said wrong. The pronunciation is not totally correct. The pronunciation is okay, it's not totally bad. The pronunci pronunciation is okay, it's not totally bad. But it's not 100% correct. The pronunciation is not 100% correct. But at the same time, he speak like he's speaking to a woman. He's using words, feminine words, that is for woman. When he asked the question, use feminine words, that is for woman, not for a man. He wants to say that he became fluent and that he, he learned a language fast. He wants to say he become fluent and he learned a language fast, but he don't know the difference. He don't know the difference between if you're speaking to a man or a woman. He don't know the difference between ma masculine and feminine in Arabic. He don't know which words to use for feminine. He don't know which words to use for masculine. And same time, it's also edited and fake. He just edit and read the question, then say the question, and he's pronounce it wrong and say it wrong. It's just some fake bullshit. I'll go back a few seconds again. I want to listen. This one is very funny.
يحلوا اي شفره لكن اللغه النوبيه كانت حاجه جديده تماما فاستفادوا بيها في حرب اكتوبر 73 هل في اي اي حاجه انت عايزه اول تول هل في اي حاجه انت انت عايزه تقول تقول also first he say اقول instead of say saying تقول because اقول اقول it means i will say he want to ask him is there something you want to say or is there want something you want to say then he ask him is there one something i want to say because he said اقول اقول it means something i'm going to say اقول it means i'm saying اقول it means i am saying that's why first he said اقول then he said تقول because first he said i am saying or i'm going to say like first he say اقول and then he said تقول I know if you don't understand Arabic, it's confusing for you. I know if you don't understand Arabic, then it's confusing for for you. But he, but but he at first he said, "Is there anything I want to say?" When you say "aul," "aul" means "aul" is when you're speaking about yourself. When you're speaking about yourself, when you're speaking about yourself, you will say "aul," like "I I want to say" or "I'm going to say" means "aul." Or I'm saying it means aul. So first he actually said, "Is there anything else I want to say?" But he changed. If he changed it, so it will become correct. He said aul, then he said taul. Like he changed because first he make mistake. He make mistake and say, "Is there something else I want to say?" Like first he make mistake and ask if there's something else he, I want to say, and then he changed it so it become. You want to say, like first he make it sound like he is saying, like first he said by mistake. First he said by mistake, is there anything else I want to say? Like he's asking the guy, is there anything else I want to say? If you can speak Arabic, why you ask him if there anything else I want to say? And then after he change it, so it will be, is there anything else you want to to say? He cannot speak correct. He cannot speak correct. Even he read from the script. He read from the script and still he will make mistake. He read from the script and edit. He read from the script and edit. Still he make mistake. Still he cannot pronounce the words. He don't know the difference between when he's talking about himself or talking about someone else. He don't know the difference if he's talking about himself or someone else. He don't know the difference if he's speaking to a man or to a woman. He don't know anything about Arabic. He don't know anything about Arabic. He want to tell you that he is very smart. He want to tell you he's very smart and he can speak. He can learn a language in three months. He want to pretend he's very smart and he can learn a language in three months. He can learn any language in three months. He want to pretend that he will learn very fast and that he knows some special methods, but he don't know anything about the language and he just edit the video and he just read one or two or three questions like that and editing and fake fuck معهم انا ممكن اشكر منظمه اليونسكو هم دايما بيحافظوا على اثار النوبه وتاريخ النوبه يمكن مصر ما اهتمتش قد اليونسكو اليونسكو عمل لنا متحف النوبه وهو دايما بيبحث عن الاثار النوبيه الغرقانه والمعابد النوبيه اللي غرقت تحت الميه هم اللي طلعوها هم اللي ساعدوا بنسبه كبيره حتى هنا في جزيره اليفانتين هم ليهم منطقه الاثريه هنا في جزيره اليفانتين حتى يومنا هذا اليونسكو دوله المانيا ودوله النمسا هم حتى الان بيحاولوا بيساعدونا وبيبحثوا معنا على اثارنا بنشكرهم يعني نشكر اليونسكو جدا okay. شكرا عفوا هي كود نوت ايفن سي وان وورد شكرا وان وورد شكرا ميس ثانك يو هي كود نوت سي ات ويز اوت ميكينج ان ايديت He could not even say one word without making an edit. I think he actually asked the guy. Maybe he asked the guy. Maybe he asked this guy how to say thank you, because the guy in the on the right side. I think he he said that he's working for for some tourist thing. See, he said this this guy. If you look at the last line or the last few lines, the last few lines. The last few lines to share that story. I let Gasir M. Anwar, a Nubian working in the tourist industry. So this guy on the right side, he is working for the tourist industry. So he can also speak English. I think he asked the guy, how do you say thank you? I think he asked the guy, how do you say thank you? Then he told him you, you should say shukran. 
I think he has the look. He's laughing. You can see the right guy on the last side. He's laughing at him. He's laughing at him because he's some clown. He cannot even speak anything in Arabic. Look the face. Look the face on the, of the guy on the right side. Look. You can you can see he's laughing. He's laughing at him because he's some <laughs> clown. He cannot speak anything in in Arabic. He could not even say thank you with or thank you without uh, editing. There was some edit just before he said thank you. There was some edit. And in Arabic, it's only one word. In English, it's two words. In English, it's like thank you. Thank you is two words in English, but in Arabic, it's only one word. In Arabic, it's only one word is shukran. Shukran. Even like anyone who cannot even speak Arabic, they, they know this shukran or some few words in Arabic. And then he cannot say it without editing. I'll go back a few seconds, then you will see something blurry because there was some edit. Try to notice after a few seconds, just before Benny Lewis say Shukran means thank you. Just before Benny Lewis say this thank you, when he say Shukran, just few seconds after this. Just before he say, say thank you, then there, there's something blurry. There's something blurry and shaking like that because there was some edit. He could not even say one word. He could not even say one simple word. Shukran means thank you. He could not say one word in Arabic without edit. He could not say one simple word in Arabic without making an edit. Just look after a few seconds and notice there's some edit. There's something blurry and shaking like that. There's some edit and after he will say Shukran. There's some shaking and blurry thing because there's an edit and then he will say this Shukran means thank you. One word. He could not say one word without edit. He could not say one word in Arabic without edit. How can you say you learn Arabic or become fluent or good in Arabic when you cannot even say one simple word shukran? Even many people who cannot speak Arabic, they can say this one word in Arabic. If you cannot say one word, simple word Arabic shukran, then you cannot speak Arabic at all. He just said this shukran with ma salama, it means like thank you and goodbye. He said shukran with ma salama means thank you and goodbye. He, he, could, he could not even say this one or two words or few words like that, like three, four words. He could not say it without some editing. You will see here after a few few seconds. After a few seconds, look at Benny Lewis and the screen like that. Look at Benny Lewis and the video. You will see there's something blurry and shaking just for a second. There's something blurry shaking because there's some edit. He could not even say a few words in Arabic. It means that he cannot speak anything in Arabic. Even people who cannot, even some people who cannot speak Arabic, they know this shukran or some few words in Arabic. If he cannot even say a few words in Arabic without edit. If he cannot say a few words in Arabic without edit, it means that he cannot speak anything in Arabic. And I'm very sure it's the same with the other language. I'm very sure it's the same with the other language. All those polyglot YouTubers are just some fake. <laughs> just look after a few seconds, there's something blurry and shaking. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I will show it now again in slow motion. Look now at Benny Lewis at his face and his body. You will see it's very blurry. It will become very blurry right now. If you look good at Benny Lewis, it will become very blurry because there's some edit. He could not even say shukran wi ma salama. Just four words. He could not say them without. He had to edit and read from the text like that. He just go and read those four words. And then after he will cut it out, he cannot even say two or three or four words in Arabic because he cannot speak Arabic. It's all fake. That's why he makes some edit. You can see how blurry his face is. If you keep looking at the face of Benny Lewis, I make it in slow motion a few times here. It's just edited and fake. He cannot speak anything in Arabic. Just some fake. All of those polyglot YouTubers are fake. All of them. 
just keep looking at his face how it become blurry like that I show it few times here if you look at Benny Lewis you see how his face become blurry because it's edited and fake it's edited and fake just some edited fake videos only asking two or three questions in the video or saying few things in the video and most of the video the other guy is speaking the other guy is speaking for like four or five minutes and Benny Lewis will just ask three questions and say goodbye like that it's very fake you cannot say anything in Arabic it's just some fake just some fake bullshit but I already know he's some fake but I just want to show here how fake this is. Let's continue. I will watch. I will show almost all his Arabic video. I think I'll show all the Arabic because I speak Arabic. So for me, this is a good way to prove how fake he is. And after, I don't know how much I'll show of the other videos. I will also show some of the other language. I will also show the other language, but I will mostly concentrate here on the Arabic because I can understand what he's saying or I can understand and see if it's fake like I can better see if it's fake when it's a language that I can speak let's go to the next video this 11 minute 11 half minute video but it says learn a dialect or modern standard Arabic I don't know if he's going to speak in Arabic or if it will be in English let's see Subscribe to my channel now. Remember to subscribe to my channel. See you. اشترك في القناة دلوقتي. افتكر اشترك في القناة. اشوفك. السلامة. وسكت ابوني اقوم القناة نور. وسكت ابوني. بسيس. ابوني بو اما شن من تنا. ابوني بو. ابوني بو اما شن.